Hey everybody, Mike here, October 23rd, 2015. Thank God it's foot, foot, foot Friday. Yes, indeed, thank God it's Friday. Thanks to everybody that subscribed last week. I do appreciate that very much. Don't forget, check out some of the old videos, leave some comments, you know what to do. A special thank you to Elrus Aman Anna for being my 7,000th subscriber. So I do appreciate that very much. Happy birthday to Liza Lindsay's little boy, Poot. Also, happy birthday to Carolyn from your daughter, Pam, and to Kelsey. Happy birthday to all of you. Hope you have a fabulous time on your B-Day. Shout outs to Martin. That's right. Marty Vlogger, shout out to you, buddy. And also, happy anniversary to Laura and Wesley. Nine years. Congratulations to you. Keep it rolling. Keep it rocking. Boom. Eh, that was okay. Hey, are you happy and excited that Halloween's coming up? Can't wait. Got all my candy. Can't wait to set up the yard on Halloween day. Gonna have a good time. Today's food jam is Boom, you got it, Filipino food hit number five. And this is just for an appreciation of how much I appreciate my Filipino subscribers. Man, I've been getting tons of them in. Keep them coming, keep them coming. Yes, indeed. Hey, man, oh, I've been dying for this. Okay, I got a couple of little containers here and I got my big container. And this one contains my rice and every time I go there, I have to get lechon kawali. I know I've tried it many times before, but I got to get on it. Oh my God. There's my sauce. There's my lechon kawali. There's my rice. Ooh, I'm so looking forward to this. I also got uh, chicken adobo, which we're going to try out. And also uh, pork adobo as well. I'm interested to see what it tastes, what the, those taste like, mainly the chicken adobo because that was, uh, my uncles had spent some time in the Philippines uh, during the war, and he learned how to make some chicken adobo, but it doesn't look exactly like this. His was more of a red, had more of a red color to it. This is more of a uh, mm, color of the meat, kind of beige looking. Oh, Filipino food hit number five. The reason I call it a food hit is not because it's like gonna be a big hit, because I don't know whether I'm going to like the food or not, but 100% of the time already I have, but it's more like a Filipino hit to my face because I know I'm going to be eating some good food. So here we go, lechon kawali. Oh, that's a one biter right there. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh my God. Mmm. The chunk of Wally is like dangerous, dangerously good. Um, I'm going to take one small piece here, save that for later. The, uh, this stuff is, no, forget the small piece. Let me go for a bigger piece. And I'll, I remember in my earlier videos, people are still commenting on it. The sauce is for the chunk of Wally. I know that now in the past several videos that I've done. <laughs> so, so good. I think the only thing that's missing with this would be a nice Filipino beer. Can you give me some hints on a brand of a uh, Filipino beer that would be good to try on my next hit because the uh, we have Total Wine, Total Wine and Bevmo, which have like brews from all over the world. So I'm pretty sure I could find it. Okay, let's try the adobo. What do I got here? Chicken or pork? I think, no, that's the pork. That's the pork adobo. So this is the chicken adobo. Oh, I got some, oh yeah, the bones are still in it and everything. Oh, wow. 
Yeah, this is that's chicken bones. All right, that's a piece of dark meat. That's like a piece of the thigh. I, ooh, mm, that was hot. All right, I'm just gonna try out the. Let me just try out the meat first. Oh my God, look at this. There's people who don't go crazy over gristle when it's the chicken gristle. Mm. I love that stuff. So crunchy and good. All right, that wasn't even a good enough bite that I was really getting because those had some bones in it. So let me just get some of this, put this on top of some of this rice here. That broth made all the difference in the world. Mmm. My goodness. It's so nice and thick. I like this. It doesn't taste the same as what my uncle used to make. But they give you a lot of bones in this. But um, I'm telling you, man, this is good. This is really good. Man, oh man. All right, I'm just gonna hit this bone. Oh my God. It's one of the knuckle joints. And I'm gonna show you how serious I am about chicken. See the, see the gristle from the joints? I'm, this, is, this is going down. Oh my God. People who have witnessed me eating wings before know how I destroy the chicken. I eat the knuckle ends off. Everything. You can hear me crunching it. Sometimes people are grossed out by it. Not this kid. Oh my God. This is bone. Is so tender, falls apart in your mouth. Oh my god, so good! All right, let's bring some of this over. Whoops. Simply wonderful. All right, let's put this one off to the side and let's try that pork adobo now. Oh, how about another piece of lechon kawali, right? Come on, I can't let that stuff sit there. Mmm. I'm gonna have to go do some hiking later. Because this is a lot of fat I'm taking in. Oh. All right. Pork adobo. Look at those chunks of meat in there. Large. Large chunks. All right. You know what? I'm just going to take the first bite of meat with some broth first. That's the way I like to check it out. I know I'm supposed to eat it with some rice, but this is the way I want to try it out first. Oh my God, so good. Oh. I can't even begin to describe the flavors But the spices that are in this is so good. And you know what? 
I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna say she didn't give me a pork adobo, she gave me a beef adobo. This is beef. It's not pork. And I'll show you. That's beef. 100%. I don't care. It's still good. Oh my god. Mmm. A little bit more. Some of that broth on top of this. With some rice. Oh. My god. Nephew Chris, we got to get down here and have lunch at this place one of these days. Son, son, you're going to love it. Completely going to love it. All right, let me get another block of this. Some juice. <laughs> oh. Oh my God. The meat is just so tender and so good. Ma'am, I'm telling you, another Filipino food hit that was a hit. Mmm. So, so good. All right. I got to save some for later. Seriously? Yes, I will. After I try a little bit more of this chunko wale. Mmm. Mmm. Just one more piece. Crispy skin. Woo! Okay, let's put this over here. Mmm. Beef adobo. Chicken adobo. Little chunk of wally with some rice, little chunk of wally with some sauce, and some rice. My God, Filipino food is the best. It's probably my next favorite after Vietnamese pho and different little meals that they have. Oh, I had a beef stew, a Vietnamese beef stew the other day. I was out with my buddy uh, Adrian, might have got a picture of us on Instagram. And uh, I tried out this beef stew. Oh my God. Nice size bowl, but it was just filled with these huge chunks of beef like that. Oh my God. I, I was getting full on the thing and I very, excuse me, I very rarely get full because I can eat like a monster. Oh, there we go. Let's all just chase it down with a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Oh my gosh. All right. Cheers, everybody. God, that was so good. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. I love limes. <laughs> Poor lime didn't know it hit it. Man, I got goof all over me. Man, I'm sloppy today. Oh boy, that's it. Oh my God, Filipino food hit number five. Lechon Kawali with the sauce. Got some chicken adobo and some beef adobo. Rockin', jammin', so darn good. That's it, man. Woo! So, so good. Get some sun. Get some exercise. Be healthy. And I'll see you when? Next time. Bye.
paper just grazed up against that Latone Kowalian. <laughs> Can you see the the grease stain there? Mm, is that skin crispy? I don't know. Let's see. Yup. 